Who's a bit be quiet and respectful for David Jiggs Johnson? Thank you very much, Ian. Here's a question for you. Does anybody like any of them really spooky ghost stories that the BBC put on at Christmas by MR James? Anybody ever watch them? Well, here's a ghost story. It's about being haunted by the ghosts of your past. It's called Secrets. Three secrets were bequeathed to me. Answers hidden that the eyes could see. No lies involved, no half-told truths. They have found me and followed me since my youth. I should have guessed, but my feet they roamed. I walked the path far from my own. So near to heart, but so far away. Just wish I could say out loud today. That cannot be done for fear and dread. Revealing the mysteries must not be said. I hold them close and will not be sad. When I see them, I am always glad. For haunted and vexed, I may always be. So keep the lock fastened, hide well the key. My three secrets are down to biology. And yet, it is autobiographical. Thanks for that, folks. Where did we are to my sleeve as usual? Last week, Ian did me a brilliant introduction because I do, I can't stand what's going on abroad at the moment. I think it's awful. He did me a brilliant introduction and I went and did a completely different poem. And I apologise for that, mate. But uh, there's two fellas over here. They're not just wearing their hearts on their sleeves, they've got the courage of their convictions. In Palestine! All my life I've watched it going on on the news, I'm 64 now, and I'm sick of it. This one is called The Light of Justice. The light that shines on the Holy Land has always been free, it has no demand. From that place came religion, whether yours or not. It's given reasons for diversions, wars and plots. It's a lovely sight for all to see, reminding those like you and me, a testament told in you. We're a time we are given a reminder, a remember and review. The words of a man, whether fact or fiction, fiction or fact, you do the math, add and subtract. The main thing is we were told in our youth the power of peace and honesty and truth. There is a tribe follows not these words, but herds others with violence and genocide. We in the free world should not abide. Wholesale slaughter and mass murder of husbands, wives, sisters, brothers, fathers, mothers and children. That should be abhorrent. Our outweigh should be a torrent. Speak out, speak up against injustice for the innocent. The only thing covering those that sleep in Palestine tonight is the light of that same star. My top last folks, thanks very much. David James Johnson, my friend. Free Palestine. Any 